Hello, so my name is Taylor. I'm a medical student at the University of Edinburgh, but I'm also an engineering graduate from Surrey University um, in medical engineering. Uh, I've been tutoring maths now for about the past five years, and today I'm going to talk to you about a particularly challenging case I had. Um, this particular student had been moved by his school from foundation to higher tier GCSE maths with about six months notice before his exam, um, which obviously threw him in the deep end somewhat because there's a lot of disparity between those two syllabi. Um, so the approach that I took after some discussion with him to figure out where he was at was instead of trying to charge through all the content we focused on the fundamentals so in the case of maths this is predominantly algebraic manipulation that's mostly what GCSE is built upon um, so he focused on that for quite a long time um, this had two effects firstly it allowed him to understand the subsequent topics that I'll talk about in a second but also it helped him learn a bit more in class because when the teacher was writing stuff on the whiteboard there was a certain level of algebra that was assumed knowledge that he didn't have and so it helped him learn the topics that they were being taught much more easily and he didn't have to panic spending hours at home trying to revise what was going on. The next thing we did after that, as I mentioned, so we, we built in some of the topics beyond algebra, but the topics that will yield the most marks in the exam. At the end of the day, when it comes to GCSEs, everything else is secondary. So what we did was I, I, I filtered the topics and started with the ones that are most commonly asked and basically yield the most marks. And also, since there's some interlinking between the topics, I picked the topics that will likely help him when it comes to the other topics that we wouldn't have time to cover. Um, and so what that did really was enable him to get as many marks as possible and everything all the questions on topics that weren't going to be covered he could have a good stab at with the algebra that he had and get a few marks um, as is the case that what you do in GCSE when you have questions that you don't understand um, so at the end through the tutoring we had over 12 weeks um, and in no small part due to the tutee's hard work of course he went from getting ones and twos in his exams to getting a six and a seven in his two marks respectively and I consider that a great success thank you